hi guys welcome to my youtube channel today i'm going to talk to you about the dream car competition uh this is the picture we have got this week guys but i have already played my uh the free ticket on it uh it was something around this area first of all guys when i get a picture i don't straight away draw the lines to see where the ball is what i do is i take the drawing line uh the cursor as a ball just to figure out a sensible place where the ball could be judging this guy's eyes and this guy's eye uh, given his body position guys i don't think he is jumping for the ball but he has already headed the ball and he's trying to land himself because looking at his hands this hand is like he's trying to balance himself when he land on the ground and this leg is also like if he's trying to jump up guys uh, the knee has to be bent like that's the normal position for a player to jump up but he this leg is stretched out and the arm is stretched out so I think this guy has already headed the ball and he's just landing himself so uh, given his head position if he has headed the ball already the ball cannot be closer to him because he is already halfway down to the ground so I think the ball has traveled away um, when you look at this guy uh, you can't really guess where he is looking because I can't see his eye he looks uh, his eye pupil looks very brown and it's not a clear picture so I'm not sure where he is looking but judges will assume that he is looking high up because uh, I think he is in the background, he is in the foreground. Guys don't just ignore this player as well because he is looking at the ball, uh, looking at his head. Guys he is looking somewhere around this area. So what I do is guys I will just place my cursor here and see if uh, this makes sense mm. like when you place the ball in this area so that means the codes will be 814682 814682 so what I do is I'll just put 814682 right right here guys so now I have a reference to work on this mark. Um, now let's go for the drawing lines. Okay, I'll just draw the lines in orange color for the eye lines of this player. This guy is clearly looking high up. And this should do. And the lower will be here in this area guys the judges will play in this area now we will just take his eye line and draw a line like this because since he's in the background judges will probably go higher in his eye lines and now this one comes lower Now guys when I when I draw the line for the lowest part just imagine uh, can a judge go in this area I don't think so so what I have to do is I just have to redo his eye line and see where the judge will go for the down this area is okay so guys this is those are my lines now I think this one okay let's see the middle of these lines Okay guys, center and the average of this picture comes around this area. So let's 
let's put a ticket there and see how it looks So placing the ball here guys, uh, it's not a bad area to play. Like this. This looks much better because when you see the blue, guy, uh, blue player's eye line, this looks pretty much okay. Uh, but here is not bad either this area is looking good taking this player into consideration i think this looks pretty right too much right to me but this looks perfect guys so this area looks pretty oh much okay because the problem guys now when the judges play they will play in this line but the question is how far they will go how far they will move the ball because i i think some judges will come this closer when they come this closer the average tends to move to right but I guess one or two, I, I'm, I'm sure one, guy, one judge will go this far and one judge will come this closer and most of them, they will play around this area. So this is my first impression guys. So this is the average, it's 695660. This looks pretty much okay for me. Uh, but I need more time to look into the picture. Uh, I have given the link below for the high resolution picture. If you guys want to have a look, please click on it. And I'll try to analyze this picture one or two days and see where I comes. But this is uh, this is not the final coordinates, guys. This is just a first impression to see where the ball is actually. So. Uh, we have to work around this area to get a better coordination uh, if you guys think otherwise like just let me know in the comment section um, and guys if you if you like the video please don't forget to like and subscribe that helps me a lot all right guys see you tomorrow with some better coordinates let's work together and win something guys see you